Okay, all welcome to a special edition of the news special late night edition, I guess. Okay, here we go. The world news first. A dad has been charged with throwing his kids off a bridge. Now, why would he do that? He must be stupid. An Alabama man has been charged with killing his four young children by throwing them off their bridge. I guess he's been charged for that. I don't know why you do that. That's just stupid and plain sad. Why would you throw your kids off a bridge? That's stupid. Okay, let's move on. Well, here's news and information about the writer's strike. Have you ever heard now? The writer's strike has caused the Golden Globes to be canned, but but the winners will be named on a live news show. Then after that, they're gonna go talk to the writers and all that, and in their I guess in their hotel or something. I don't know. I don't know where. Apparently, the writers strike strike us again, folks. Yep. So let's hope we can get this writers strike over. It's getting ridiculous. Oh, you know what the cause is? They didn't let any, no stars will show up to the right, going low because they're supporting the writer strike. Just plain sad how the world is doing today. Okay, I guess we'll move on to wrestling news and I'll give you some of my thoughts since we got a little time. Wait, that's it? Yeah, okay. EC, for ECW this weekend, the rain got a ECW is still low in the rain. That same one last week, I bet it's 1.2, I think. Yep. That's just plain stupid. Vince really needs to repay ECW. Again, Vince, you're not doing nothing. ECW is going to fail unless you don't do nothing. Listen to me, Vince. Fix ECW. Okay, there's been a new match added to the Royal Rumble card now. It's going to be Ro Ric Flair who versus MVP. My guess if Ric Flair loses this match, his career is over, but do you think the U.S. title will be on the line? Possible. I don't know. I haven't heard much about it, so to wait and see. And for TNA news, well, they're going to do a drug test. Well, that's good. It's good to check these wrestlers for steroids or drugs and all that, because what happened last year with Chris Benoit, that was pretty sad, yep. So, you better check these wrestlers as you can. See what's, and if they found drugs in them, they just at least suspend them like WWE does. At least they're doing a little better job, but I think WWE needs to check Big Daddy V, because it looks pretty big. Kind of scary, yep. Okay, the raw rating, well, they're a little low because only a 3.2 for raw roulette, whatever you call it. I thought the raw, the spin the wheel thing was dumb this year because they didn't really have it. I mean, they only saw Vince do it a couple of times, three. It's ridiculous. So, raw roulette, disappointing this year for me. Okay, for TNA, well, here's some more news. Make sure you guys watch the Global Impact Special tomorrow. It's going to be Japan versus TNA Wrestling. And all, all I know for the match tomorrow is going to be Amazing Con or whatever names versus Gail Kim. That should be a good matchup. Well, I will be watching that one tomorrow. Yeah, that's for sure. And my thoughts on the Royal Rumble? Well,. Jeff Hardy versus Randy Orton, well, I think that Randy Orton will probably retain because WWE likes Randy Orton better as a champ. Now look for Cena, you can't see me, he's coming back man, he'll be the champ. Another, for the Royal Rumble match, I'm not going to go on a whole list because I don't have enough time, but I don't think. I don't want to be this really long. For the Royal Rumble this year, well, Triple H is not in it, but I bet she somehow gets in the here at the end or something. I don't know. So probably if he's not in, I don't know who's gonna win. About to see more names be announced. Don't tell me Hornswoggle is gonna win it. 
Horny, what if he wins the World Rumble? What would everybody think about that? <laughs> that would be the ridiculous thing i ever seen in my entire life. If he wins and goes on to WrestleMania to take on the champ. Give me a break. You don't think Vince McMahon is going to have him win, in, win, win the championship at WrestleMania. Oh, God. Hope not. That would be disastrous. <laughs> Well, that's pretty much it for the news here tonight. Hope you enjoyed it. Sorry for the start, but well, it's late night here. It's past one o'clock, and I'm tired. So have a good night. Bye, everybody. Booyah. Who said that? I don't know. Yeah. By the way, this wrestling news and the world is sponsored by Green Tea. Go on and get yourself some green tea. It's very good today. Ooh, ooh. Bye for now. Ouch.